Hello everyone, Charles Wallen. We're back again with another cigar video for you. And this video is about how to light a cigar. Not only am I going to show you how to light a cigar, I'm going to give you, I'm going to show you the different techniques and then also the different, different means to light a cigar. We're going to go over the different types of uh, lighters, matches, and things like that. So first, let's get started with what you shouldn't use. Number one, you should not use your Bic lighter you got from the convenience store. You should not use book matches. Reason why you don't want to use those is because of the chemicals involved to light that match and the gas used to light that lighter. We, the, it's just, it's cheaper materials. And the biggest thing, the practical thing with the matches as you'll see, you're gonna need multiple matches to do that. It will take you forever and you might even use the whole book lighting one cigar. Let me first talk about toasting. What you need to do to get a cigar lit properly is to properly toast a cigar. When you're properly toasting the cigar, you're helping or ensuring an even burn. And the even burn makes a huge difference on how good that cigar experience is going to be. The first thing you need to do is have your lighter set on low, not high. As low as possible, that's where you want it. Right there. The next thing and, and the most important thing is to get the entire cigar lit. To accomplish this, you must toast the foot of the cigar. Lightly and gradually, heat up the foot, constantly turning the cigar. You may see some light smoke, but you should not see any real flames. When using a smaller lighter with a, just a single torch, it, the same thing applies. Constantly turning the, the cigar, and you do want to see smoke, but again, you don't want to see any flames. Lightly blow on the foot in order to see the glow of the embers or the cherry. Go over the areas that need more attention. If done correctly, you would never need to bring the lighter to the cigar while taking a draw, like a person would do lighting a cigarette. That first technique is very time consuming. Let me show you a quicker way, but not so preferred way. You will still need to toast the cigar in the same fashion, but you will not attempt to get the foot red hot. You will turn the entire foot black. This time, take the cigar to your mouth, take a draw with the lighter on the foot of the cigar. While toasting and taking the draw, do not have the flame right on the cigar. You want to have it at least a half inch away from the cigar. You, don't forget, you still want to turn the cigar throughout the lighting process. Now here's the most difficult way to light a cigar with matches. Again, you want to make sure you use nice, thick, big stick matches. First thing, allow the striking air and igniting chemicals to burn off. Now, holding at an angle, place the cigar on the flame. The orange flame of the wood is cooler than the blue flame of the butane. Just like the torch lighter, you would need to rotate the cigar to ensure the foot becomes completely and equally lit. As you can see, this will take a number of matches. Be careful not to burn your fingers.
at no time did I take a draw while having the match on the cigar's foot. Let me show you the preferred way, cedar sticks, or otherwise known as spills. These are nothing more than very large match sticks. The same technique of lighting the cigar with a match stick will apply. You will need not to worry about burning off chemicals. You may have to use more than one spill to get the cigar completely lit, depending on the cigar's gauge or otherwise known as the whip. Yes, this way is absolutely time consuming also, but this is the best way to get the most out of your cigar. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, those are my techniques of how to light cigar properly with different means. If you have your own technique, go ahead and leave a comment below. Please make sure you hit the like button and don't forget to share and subscribe if you have not already. I'm Charles Wallingford. In these lighters, in these spills, in these matches are how I spent my money. How would you spend your money?